As dawn broke, he arose. Jesus was coming for his kingdom. Coming to save man from sin. Coming to crush the hold of death from within. Coming so man could live with him forever. But man's heart did not desire his saving grace. He came humbly on the unbroken foal of a donkey. As he entered the city, the people rejoiced, but Jesus wept. You see, the crowds didn't want forgiveness and mercy. They desired an earthly victory. They followed Jesus for misguided reasons. They followed his works, but denied the freedom in his words. He came for a spiritual kingdom, not of earth, but the kingdom of heaven. And though legions of angels knelt before him, he did not come to wage war on the Romans, but to wage war on religion. That cancerous hypocrisy driven by pride, which concluded that the sinner should be shamed and excluded. But these very sinners were the purpose of his crucifixion. Make no mistake, Jesus did not die a victim. He was instead the willing sacrifice for our sin. We worship Jesus today, not because of what he may do for us, but because of who he is to us, our King, our Messiah, and our God, who brought his kingdom through a cross, the heavy cross that pointed to a promise, a revelation, that one day will stand with every nation, tribe, and language. Palm branches lifted high, one voice united in a deafening cry. Salvation belongs to our God. Jesus is here. His kingdom is here. Hi, this is Pastor Bob, and this weekend is going to be Palm Sunday. And I want to invite you to church this Sunday, because it's through Christ and the triumphal entry and going out on the cross and through the resurrection that we're going to celebrate this whole next week that we have everlasting life. Many people only come to church a couple of times a year, usually Easter or Christmas. But I want to invite you not only to just come on Palm Sunday and Resurrection Sunday, but I would like to invite you also to consider Christ for your life. Because this is a good time to think about what Jesus did for us in the triumphal entry. That night in Matthew 21, 1 through about verse 8, actually through the Hosannas, it goes in from late Sunday night into early Monday morning. They go down, and he, or uh, Jesus asked his disciples to go down and get a, a donkey and untie it and bring it to him. And he was going to come in on this donkey. And that's what we're going to talk about on Sunday is Palm Sunday coming in and the, what we know now as a triumphal, triumphal entry or Palm Sunday. But it's a good time to reflect on what Christ did. As they went to Bethphage that, that night, they prayed and he would come in on a donkey and he would give his life for us on that cross. So come and join us this Sunday. Consider Jesus Christ. Our service starts at 10 o'clock, uh, 10 a.m. We're going to have a special Sunday school class on at 9 a.m. So if you would be inclined to come and visit with us and be with us, we would really love to have you there. So God bless you and hopefully see you this Sunday.